Attack, fanny pack attached, tokens are all stacked, got the mallet in my grasp, waiting for the moles, ha, hiding in their holes, score we're keeping tally, I'll be playing till they close now, can't nobody beat my high score, you can't beat my high score, can't nobody beat my high score, you can't beat my high score. I'm a mallet master, a single fisted blaster. You can ask my baby, it starts slow, then gets faster. I'm a when you take care of people, people take care of you in this community. That's the truth. So, everyone, please remember that. Even if we're competitors, we're not enemies. All right, gonna. Get this ready to ship out to the customer here in about half an hour or so. I'm gonna. I need to put the anode cup back on, so we'll do that together. And I need to put this over the neck board, and then I'm gonna zip tie some of these uh, loose wires, make it look a little cleaner, like I usually do. But no problems with this one. Uh, I did have some kind of funky solder joints on it that I noticed after I got done so I just went through it and refloated it the proper way took all the solder off cleaned it up and then uh, put some new solder back on there there was let's see there's a couple resistors right here in this corner that looked like they were starting to burn up or get overheated but other than that it uh look pretty good once you cleared away the layer of filth and uh, same with the power supply I didn't see any problems with it the caps actually they look new considering there was like this much dust on the inside so once I uh, clean that off yeah they, they look fine so nothing really extra to do there I actually uh, had to blow it out three or four times I just blew it out again and, and got another like coffee mug full of crap to come out of it. I thought I had one more little one. Let's drop it. Yep, just get this wrapped up and then uh, got some Duncan Alien parts. Transistors for that hopefully are coming in. And I need some uh, resistors because I have a feeling it's, it's got bad resistors on that board too. I have a feeling that it's not going to fix it with just the transistors. Mostly because that's my luck. I've already, I've already fixed that way a bunch of times, and then all of a sudden here lately, it wasn't enough. So I'm not confident that that's going to do it alone. If I get time today, I'll, I'll pull that board again. I mean, the game's off, so pull the board again and look at it. Maybe test the, some other stuff that, in that circuit near that transistor. Okay, we got that all set up. Let's go ahead and do the exciting part. Discharge this bad boy. I don't expect to see any spark. This thing's been off for so long. If it had a spark, I'd be shocked. Nada. Good news. I'm sure I'm on frame here. Yes, I do have something blues in frame. <laughs> One of my buddies made fun of me. It's not that I try to do it. It's just going to happen no matter what. <laughs> I found some more blue stuff I wanted to buy at the gas station last night, too. I'm a sucker. Okay, get this back here. Let's go ahead and do the anode cup. Yeah, that's all right, man. Get everything. Zip tied up while I was working on the chassis. So it's handy to have done. Let's go ahead. We're gonna go 
this way. So it's a little twist tie dealy over here. I'll try to keep it off that neck as much as possible. I had a old golden tee. It had a wire that would fall across the 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 yoke and the neck right here, and it would start arcing. And uh, I sold it. And I told the gal that I sold it to that like, after you move it, it's probably going to have that ground wire fall across the yoke and it's going to start arcing. She didn't pay any attention to me and she got it home and it was arcing. She sold it for 50 bucks and it worked. It's like, oh well, what can you do? Even when you tell somebody the answer, they just don't want to hear it. So this one isn't going to be very exciting, obviously, but uh, they aren't always. You get this one buttoned up. I, I don't know uh, if I have anything else to film today, so I figured I'd go ahead and film this just in case, so I have something to put out tomorrow. I got uh, videos stacked up right now so that I'm not releasing videos at midnight or 11 o'clock at night try to go like four, three or four every day. Okay, let's get rid of this one. So Mike got his uh, slick shot going. Well, I got a slick shot going. Well, he, he did change a transistor on the board, which I gotta be proud of him for that because I think that's his first transistor swap. All right, I'm gonna go back here. It's gonna be real easy doing this. Just kind of work it on there. Same way, work it off whenever it's ready to come off. You gotta be a little firm. You don't want magic smoke to come out. All right. Let's brown the wire back on. And that ought to wrap her up. Just got to do one last thing and put the uh, cap to buy sticker on there. Be right back. Okay, this is just the last part. We're gonna tag it so that everybody knows that it has been worked on, when it was worked on, and who worked on it. And so, I did film this, but this one didn't have much room, but it does, I like how it has the different options of other things to do. Most of them just say cap kit. But you get one done by me, you'll get a Matty Mo sticker. And, be kind of funny in five, six years, and people are running into my Matty Mo stickers, and they're like, "Oh man, your solder job sucked." That's it. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, I got something else to film today, and we won't see this one for a while. <laughs> see ya. So these two right here are going to be ground and five volt. So what do we do right here? Did I not turn the game on? I didn't turn the game on. I guess that would help. Yeah. Here it is. A nice little trade. The person I traded got what they wanted. I got what I wanted. And a pretty good deal on it, too. So I'm going to get what I want! <laughs> <laughs> that comes later. Yeah! Okay. It's, it's, it's on fire. What happened? Whoa. Lots of smoke. Well, that's bad. Yeah, well, thanks for watching. <laughs>